Thank you for joining me for this short demonstration of some of my favorite pieces of Leah Sophia jewelry. Before I do that, let me just give you a brief background on Leah Sophia as a company. It has been in business for over 30 years. It was originally the Remington Jewelry, which was part of the Remington Shavers Company. When the owner of Remington Shavers passed away, he left the company to his son, who then sold the razor business and kept just the jewelry and named it after his daughters, Leah and Sophia. So if any of you are old enough to remember Remington Jewelry, this is the same line. It's been much improved over the years. First of all, the one that I want to talk about is called The Great Expectations. Now, The Great Expectations is made from mother of pearl and rhodium. The silver in all of our jewelry is rhodium, which is part of the platinum family. Now, what is, makes The Great Expectations so special is it is one of our genius clasp pieces meaning it can be taken apart and worn separately. As you notice here, we have the three separate, I'm sorry, the three pieces put together. Now when you take this apart, it has what they call a genius clasp. Now the genius clasp is basically two lobster claws. It's very simple to take apart. You just simply take the ends apart and now you have three individual necklaces which can be worn however you like, whether you want to wear them each by themselves, they can be brought together into, into two together, and simply attach them with the Genius Clasp. Again, that is the great expectations, and very versatile and can be worn many ways. Now the next piece that I want to bring to your attention is called the Improv. Now, the reason that I always want to talk about the Improv is the improv, you can see that, is made up of all three individual metals, meaning it is made from the gold plated, the hematite plated, which is the black, and the rhodium plated. When you wear a necklace like the improv, which can be worn long or very easily doubled, to make short, or there is always a very fun way of making a necklace short by unhooking it and wrapping it around twice and hooking it again. So, the as again, what I was saying about the improv is having all three different metals in it. It allows you, as your focal piece, which means the piece that people are going to notice as soon as they look at you, as your focal piece, you can mix any metals that you like. Once you have on a piece like the improv, your earrings can be silver, they can be gold, they can be black. Once you have on a piece like this, you can do whatever you want with mixing your metals. And as far as mixing your metals, the experts say that try to keep your metal mixture to one part of your body. For example, I, I have a gold wedding ring, but I like to wear silver on the other hand. That's fine. What you don't want to do is you don't want to put silver on your neck and gold on your ears, which only makes sense. Because if you get a little too crazy like that, you're going to come out looking like a gypsy. Okay, the next piece that I want to bring out is called the ocean air. Now, the ocean air is a very nice example of the quality of work of Leah Sophia Jewelry. The, the ocean air is made up of the rhodium, the resident, resin beads, and mother of pearl, and abalone, of course. Now, with the, I don't know if you can see all the brilliant colors that are part of the ocean air. The ocean air, as well as the improv, is a good length that can be doubled. It can be, it's very, very pretty when you wear it long. And, let's see if you can see that. And as, as well as that, there is some pieces that we have, like the wallflower, that look wonderful layered with the ocean air. So see, because the wallflower is completely made up from the abalone. So you've got the abalone and the mother of pearl all going together. It's a beautiful, beautiful example of the quality of the, the, all the natural stones used 
by Leah Sophia. Now I know some people take a look at our jewelry and they say, I don't get dressed up enough to wear something like that. Well, there is a word called casual glam. I throw it around out there a lot because most of this jewelry, no, let me correct myself, all of this jewelry can be worn with a sweater and a pair of jeans. Now my friend here, she's gonna strip down a little bit for us and I'm going to show you what I'm speaking of. If you take, she takes her little blouse off here and takes it down just to something you might have on in the summer months or perhaps even um, over the holidays. And we have a piece here that I wanted to bring out that is called the vault. Now the vault is a, a cross that is made with hematite and cr cut crystals. All the Sophia jewelry, all the crystals are cut and placed by hand. Now when you see something in the book that says crystals, be looking for some bling because all of these crystals are going to shine whether you hit them just right in the sunshine or you're in an elevator with the fluorescent light. So I'm gonna put the vault on my friend here while she is wearing her little tank top. Again, now you've got the casual glam. She could also add the ring and necklace that I have on with her outfit and a pair of jeans. And she's all set to go out for the evening. So uh, if you have any more questions, have any questions at all, please put them in the comments, comment section and I'll be happy to answer you. Again, our stones are all natural stones. The, um, the gold is 14 to 24 karat gold. The black is hematite and the silver is from the rhodium fam the platinum family named rhodium. Don't forget casual glam. Hope you enjoyed this short presentation and comment me with any questions. Thank you.